With the potential for hundreds of Little Rock School District teachers to strike, students are planning a protest of their own. Thank you for joining us tonight at 10. I'm Craig O'Neill. And I'm Marlisa Goldsmith. Tonight, THV 11's Melissa Ziguich shows us why some students are planning on not showing up to school on Wednesday. Craig, Marlisa, over the last few months, we've heard from plenty of teachers and parents about the fate of LRSD. But this is one of the first times we're hearing from students, and many of them are not happy with what's going on. We want to show that we care because we deserve better. Morgan Peters and Diane Cooper are both seniors at Parkview High School. It was something that was just going around. They say this Wednesday, some high school students in the Little Rock School District are planning a sick out. The parents will call the schools. Cooper says the day is in support of their teachers. They're very proud that we're trying to be an advocate for them because as we all know that they can't really be an advocate for themselves. Peters is the Parkview student body president. Thursday, she posted about the sick out on Instagram from Parkview's page. It has since gained attention from hundreds of students and parents from other schools. We've been getting mo the most feedback from Central, McClellan and Hall. Obviously a student voice is important. There's a lot of ways that student voice can be used. Superintendent Michael Poor says he is very against skipping school. We want to have kids in school and uh, participating in, in the educational environment. That's what we have to be about. He says students could get in trouble. We have policy that kind of governs what we do with either students or with staff, and we do have to follow that. We're just being an advocate for those teachers, our younger siblings that's also in the Little Rock School District. Both Peters and Cooper say they were nervous about calling in. Now I'm comfortable because I feel like this is the right thing to do. Because they say it's important to stand with their teachers. This is heartbreaking. And and seeing their reactions and hearing some of their stories about how they feel, I just really feel bad. Now, during the sick out, Peter says students will meet in front of in front of Governor Asa Hutchinson's office at 1 p.m. Wednesday to ask him questions about the return to local control and the teachers union.